sure I know you. I'm Frick with the clown. Yeah, I know you from some place. Give me back my baby, please. Get out of my for me, he got away. This is the license number right here. It's a blue four-door sedan. Now, Victoria Simpson indicated it was Paul Marshall who was driving. Okay, you get any idea where it's headed? It was headed on the Cabrillo Road in Santa Barbara. Okay, uh, have they called the police? Yeah, yeah. So, all right, call them back and make sure they understand there's children involved, all right? Go, 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 If you hide yourself behind those cold stone walls of your daddy's house, that pain is never gonna go away. I'm fine. I guess I just wasn't ready to go out like that. I got tired, so I came home. Kane has remembered something, and I think it's very important. I'm kind of tired, Kelly. Just will you listen to this one thing? He remembers the night of the Orient Express, when he dragged you out. He said he was protecting you. He didn't say from who or from what. I think it was from that someone that tried to kill you in the mountains, even. Hi, you. Hey, where's Cruz? What are you doing back so early? He's not here. Everything all right, sweetheart? Yes, I'm fine. I just got tired and I came home. I would really appreciate it if everybody would just leave me alone. Come on, come in here. Tell me about the festival. the way I acted at the festival. I know I said I wouldn't, but I had a couple of drinks, and when I saw you with Cruz, I got jealous. I know I don't, I don't have any right to, but um, I just hope that the way I acted wasn't the reason you left early. You know, I don't know why everybody thinks that it's always what I'm reacting to. You know, I have feelings and problems that don't concern anybody else. I'm sorry, I was just trying to... You were to... trying to help. You are trying to help just like everybody else. Well, you're not helping me right now, so why don't you just leave me alone? That's the last thing you need, lady. You, you were really something else, you know that? I fell in love with you up in those mountains. Now, that may not mean a whole lot to you, but it means a hell of a lot to me. Kelly tried to tell you the things that I was remembering. I know this hasn't been the greatest day for you. Things aren't going terrific for me either, but I'm remembering things that scare me. What things? I, I don't know. Maybe, maybe I'm just trying to justify the things that I did, but I, I keep remembering having to protect you. D does that make any sense? I mean, did I ever say anything to you that would indicate that that's what I was trying to do? No. Although you did say something to me before you were shot about being able to explain. I said I could explain it to you. Yeah. I, I, I mean, those weren't your exact words, but... In a certain sense. I mean, I don't know. Things were happening too quickly. When I woke up, you were there at the hospital. And then you brought me home here with you. You must have sensed something. You wouldn't have done any, all those things for me if you thought I'd hurt you. I don't know. Okay? I don't know why I do things.
thing sometimes. Now, I'm sorry that you're having a problem. But I can't do anything to help you. If Cruz upsets you this much, why did you go with him? Because I love him. If you love him, why aren't you with him now? <gasps> Things aren't that simple. We don't run away from the people we love. I don't really want to talk about this with you. Okay. Why not? Don't you think I'm sensitive enough to understand it? You know, I know the only reason you're keeping me here, the only reason you tolerate me is because you think I'll help you walk again. No, that's not true. Don't lie to me, Edie. You lied to me in the mountains. You told me you loved me. And I, 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 I wanted it so badly that I believed it true. But you, you didn't love me. The only person you ever cared about was Cruz. And I may not remember everything, but I still feel the pain from that. You know, we can't keep going through this. You think I want to? You think I want to keep remembering the things that I'm remembering? I hate it! I wish I could go back to not remembering anything. You have to know what your life was like. You have to know what you've been through. It's important. I want to not remember anything. That's what I want to go back to. Because I can't stop these little memories from creeping back into my head. They're not good memories, Eden. They scare me. And you know what? I am scared to death that I'm going to remember everything. Kane. Kane, wait. Marshall was out of town. We all thought the clan had been hanging around there all day. There was no reason to think this was going to happen. Damn, Timmons, I hate him. You should have prosecuted that man. Oh, God, Chip, it's got to be all right. It's I do believe that's his right. car. Oh, look at the mother. Oh, my God. Oh, no, Step on it. Get in there. Give me the road. Don't get in there. We'll try to take him now. He's going to floor it. We'll have a high speed chase on our hands. Your babies are in the car with the man. I don't think that's a good idea. What's wrong? Where's Kate? He ran out. What happened? I don't know. Everything's out of control. Honey, I hope you realize that you never could control Kane. Mama, I brought him in this house, and he fought me all the way. I tried helping him, and he's remembering. And now what he's remembering is torturing him. I know, but you cannot blame yourself for that, Eden. Kelly, I have to take responsibility for it. I mean, I brought him here so he could help me walk. I mean, I didn't even think what was going to happen to him. I've been selfish, and not just to Kane, to Cruz. I'm making a horrible mess out of everything. Now, wait a minute. Now, just wait a minute. There is nothing that's been done that can't be remedied. You know that. I'm going to go out and see if I can find him. He shouldn't be out in the condition he's in. Will you try the beach? Sometimes he likes to go there. I will. And listen, don't worry about Kane. Just do what's right for you, okay? See you in a minute. Absolutely right. You know that? Now, you're sitting here thinking that you've been selfish. You know what you've been doing ever since you got home? Trying to anticipate what other people need and want. I've made all the wrong decisions. I mean, I thought I was protecting Cruz. All I've been doing is hurt him. I've lied to him. I've lied to myself. Honey, you've been trying to protect Cruz. You've been so busy pushing him away to protect him 
But I think you forgot to realize what your life would be like without him. I wouldn't have a life without him. I love him. And he's right. The love that I felt for him is what has made me able to live through all of this. <laughs> it's great to hear this, you know? I'm so glad you're telling me, but you shouldn't be here talking to me about it. You should be go talking to the man himself, and I think you should go right away. You're right. I need him, Mama. Do you want me to drive you? No. <laughs> I'll drive myself. I'll take the van. Mama, I don't think I'll be coming home tonight. I hope you don't. You know, for the first time in a long time, I feel sort of happy. <laughs> oh, honey, this is just the beginning. You and Cruz are going to be happy for a long, long time. Nothing's standing in your way now. Sweetheart, but boys get a higher price. think so, huh? No, not Cruz can see him. Hey, man. Oh, he wouldn't hurt a defenseless kid, would he? Stop it. Stop it. Now! Castillo, if you don't drop the gun, I'm going to kill you. You're going to kill me if I drop the gun. Why should I do that? Because you don't want Tori's kids to get hurt, man. Look it. Just because you have a beef with Tori doesn't mean you have to hurt the baby. Just lower the gun. We'll talk about this, Paul. I'm bored with this, Castillo. Kidnapping, murder. It doesn't make a difference. Don't you get that, man? I will kill his kids if you push me. I will kill his I wouldn't even think twice about it. All right, all right. I'm going to put down the gun. Just don't hurt the boy. I'm going to put down the gun. Thank you. I'll just slide it over there. That's an easy, man. Let's go. Sure. Now turn around. Turn around. I'll turn the gun, man! All right, I'm going to turn around. Don't you hurt that kid, man. Somebody's trying to rip me off. This bottle could not have been full.
Jane, come on. Come on, get up. Ian, Ian, I... No, no. I love you. It's I Kelly. love you. It's Kelly, Jane, it's Kelly. Come on. Oh, you're so beautiful. You're very beautiful, you know that? Yeah, and you're drunk. Come on, get up. Come on. I don't, I don't know who you are. I don't know who you... I don't know who I am. I, this is a world full of strangers. Oh, well, this strain is going to get you home. Where is he? Cruz has been gone 15 minutes by now. He should have been able to find the baby. He's right on his tail. He's going to get you. He'll get you. How do you know that? You have your baby. I may never see my baby again. I'm sorry. Stop thinking like that. How am I supposed to think, Julia? You should yeah. believe that Chip is going to... He's gonna get Chip back. If you only knew. Cruz, you gotta find him. What you're looking for? You leave that here. Just get the hell out, man. No, I'm not going anywhere. My friend. Neither are you. Well, you're a fool. No, no, you're the fool. I keep asking you to do things and you just never listen, do you? I ask you to leave town, but you're here. I ask you to not steal babies and uh it's gonna stop. Here it's gonna stop now. No, it's not gonna stop. It's not gonna stop, man. If I go down, you are going down with me, and we all know that. I don't care. He just gotta pull it. No, I don't care about this. You know what? I'm finally going to do what you said I wasn't capable of doing. I'm going to do the right thing. I don't care if he goes to the cops and tells them everything. I'm going to do the right thing. He's going to not leave this room with that baby in his hand. Do you understand me? What's wrong with you? Are you out of your mind? You still the sweat off you. All you have to do is turn your back. Well, I'm sick of turning my back, my friend. We're going to go down to the precinct. You're going to give the baby to his mother. I think... I just didn't expect you to take it so much to heart. I think it's wonderful that, that you want to do the right thing. It's just that there's one little problem. What? See, I could be incriminated in all this. That's what you're concerned about? Don't you worry about the greater good? Yes, I'm all for the greater good. I just don't want to spend 20 years of my life with a bunch of butch cellmates in order to get it. Excuse me. There's one little thing you guys have overlooked. Keith, he has a very good point there. Now, I'm going to get out of here. You guys get out of my way. And I intend on catching that plane. Get out of my way, please. You go to hell.